clever boy. <laughs> everyone Bo here from BZ hub obviously today we're out getting another monster fish and uh, the monster fish of choice today is of course the Tyrana trout from Rocky Lake and uh, luckily I'm all camouflaged up I'm camouflaged as a Tyrannosaurus you can totally tell can't you can you use your imagination use it <laughs> I tried so hard <laughs> I was looking at the pictures. I was like, okay, this is look this is gonna look so good. And then by the end of it, it just it doesn't look like a T-Rex. Anywho, doesn't matter. It's the point. It's the principle. It's the principle of the thing. We're out here at Rocky Lake. Let me show you what I'm looking at. Rocky Lake here in Fishing Planet. And I tell you what, everyone, I'm ready to catch some freaking Tyranno trout, bro. Um, I just did have a little uh, message up here that did say that the uh, Rocky uh, Tyranno trout monsters here. Maybe if I uh, do a different mission and do it again, let's see. There we go, popped up here again. These monsters are all over the lake, but prefer to hunt their victims at night. So we're gonna have to switch to nighttime and uh, start fishing for these Tyranna trout. I really don't know what to expect. I have heard that uh, sometimes if you don't catch all 10 of them in one night, then you have to move on to the next night um, and try again, which is absolutely fine because we can switch nights. No big deal. Um, I do have the Tyranna trout lure uh, already. It's called the turtle spoon, fourth uh, quarter ounce, I suppose one odd hook um, it's got a shape of a turtle around it and that's really cool we have a three to nine pound feather light reel seven foot here we have the 13.2 pound ghost reel 3000 I I wanted to use some type of Halloween something okay so that's what that what that was my way of using some sort of a Halloween something or other I just switched over to using some fluoro line right there so we'll be using that for the Tyranno trout but one thing I am um, worried about and I haven't really seen a lot of is that with the dendrofin um, it was biting through our leaders and so I put on that titanium leader again just to make sure that uh, if it is going to cut through something uh, hopefully that will uh, keep it from happening so uh, yeah but without further ado I think we should uh, get into this and see if we can catch one everyone I'm excited hope you are too let's switch to nighttime and give this a go all right, it is nighttime at Rocky Lake right now. I'm not really sure where we should uh, cast out to. It's so funny being back here at Rocky Lake and at nighttime, I don't know why, but it just, it really shows how small this place is. I mean, uh, like, I don't know why, but this always felt like such a, like a, a big mountain lake or something like that uh, when I first started playing, but um, yeah, looking at it now, little different story. I'm gonna start with the stop and go as always. My go-to um, retrieve method. You know, you wouldn't think that these would be super hard to catch uh, in comparison to like the dendro fin, for instance, because, uh, you know, obviously you gotta catch 10 of them in, in a night is the idea, so, so yeah. Wouldn't think it would be that hard. Not super sure where to cast out to. I just remembered that when I was fishing at Rocky Lake, all the big rainbow trout and stuff I was catching were out there. Um, I don't know. It might be useful to actually like pay attention and see where. I mean, I saw some fish jumping over there, so maybe we should cast out over here. It might be good to actually see where fish are like uh, showing movement. You know, let's look at the depth of this place. Weird that there's so many like little streams and stuff on the outside of it. Big old pocket here in the middle. It, why is this all over here and stuff? There's even a deep section over there. Strange. Let's just cast out into the deeps and just see if we can pull anything out of here. Also don't know if I should be going towards the bottom or if it should be closer to the top. I honestly have no idea. Here we got something. No way! There we go! Our first monster Tyranna trout. Look at this dude. Oh my gosh, look at those teethers. Oh! Whoa! <laughs> we gotta look at this dude. 
Oh my goodness gracious. Hinel, what do you think? You've caught a Tyranitrout. What do you think of your Tyranitrout? Tyranitrout caught. Boom, boom. That is awesome. And uh, as always, I love the detail, the, s the scales, the, the red blood and everything. Oh, obviously, it's red blood. Uh, but yeah, fantastic. Little yellower than my my Tyrannosaurus. Uh, if you already forgot that I am a Tyrannosaurus instead of a rabid Yoda or something like that. I mean, yeah, uh, it's this is awesome. Nine more to go. Let's stop talking. We got we got we got fish to catch. Come on. Here we go. We get another one. No, it's a, it's a different fish. Okay. I was gonna say it doesn't seem as heavy as the other one. Young little rainbow trout. Rainbow trout, of course, always putting up some sort of fight. I'm kind of wanting to try this spot again. I'm always pulling trout out of this spot when I was first fishing at Rocky Lake. I just, all I remember about Rocky Lake was, that, oh golly, there we go. We got to land in another one. We're into another one, boys. Ramp off that rock. <laughs> just don't get off. There we go. Get over here. Oof. There we go, another Tyranna Trout. That is so sweet. Three pounds, 0 0.76, 0 0.076, mind you. Um, that is so cool. <laughs> oh my god. It's like I wanna like, I wanna move the camera so I can fit the whole fish in there, but then I can't have the flashlight on its freaking face there. Ah, that's so awesome. Okay, keeping this dude. Let's keep going. 3.076, I'm not sure what the other one was. Uh, three, oh, 4.099. So 4.099 is our biggest one so far. Let's uh keep it going and see if we can get some more. We need eight more, everyone. This is a lot faster than the dendrofin. <laughs> Poor Bowbeard. Poor Captain Bowbeard fished for that darn dendrofin for so long. It was crazy. Now, now all of you are worried about, worried about my personality. Oh, poor Bo. Split personality syndrome. He's gone crazy making all these YouTube videos. We shouldn't have pushed him so far. <laughs> and now he's dressed up like a leaf with teeth. Ah, oh, it's so sad. A rabid uh, vegan eating salad. <laughs> and we got a small, oh, no, it is a big, it is. I was gonna say, I think we got another small little fish here. Oh, it is a small fish. Gosh dang, all that. All that pressure on that uh, on that rod there. The rod is like the uh, the weakest link right now. Uh, all that pressure on that rod. I thought we had another Tyranitar out. Gosh dang it! There we go. That's some pressure right there. I don't think this is a Tyranitar out though. I think this is a darn rainbow. <laughs> Goodness gracious! Rainbow trout. I'm telling you, if this is not a rainbow trout, I'm gonna feel stupid. But hey. Oh, it's a trophy cutthroat trout. Okay, that's why. Here we go. Got another one here. Gosh dang it, another trout. And not the Tyranno variety. You get f further along in the levels and stuff, and then you get to the point where you're going to go go back to fish at different places, and you're thinking to yourself, well, I don't want to overpower the fish. I want it to be a little bit of fun. Maybe I'll keep it, you know, the fish are like four pounds maximum. I'll use a nine pound rod and stuff like that and a reel and stuff. Next thing you know, you're fighting a stupid rainbow trout out to a hundred some yards. Here we go. A unique cutthroat trout. Well, good gosh. Beat my personal record for a cutthroat trout, I guess. <laughs> How stupid is that? Gosh dang it. Come on. Stop giving me cutthroat trout. I don't want any more cutthroat. I want a tyranno trout. Uh, I think I'm just going to cast out towards these rocks. Oh, fish jumping over there. Fish jumping over there. Let's go. There we go. That's a big one. Oh, I didn't see it when it jumped out. Get in here, you freaking dinosaur. There we go. 3.634. I think that's our smallest one of the night. That's okay though, Tyranitrout out. This has Tyranitrout all over it. Everyone knows that the Tyranitrout like to hang out by logs. Oh yeah, that that's what I meant. Young cutthroat trout like to hang out by logs. That's why that's what I was trying to say. That's why I was trying to say 
I'll eat you, bro. I'm a freaking dinosaur. There we go. That's the drag I like to see. There we go. Got another Tyranitrout. I sped up the lure a little bit, thinking, you know, Tyranitrout, being the vicious predator it is, doesn't mind chasing down a little, little turtle. Doesn't mind chasing down a little turtle. So, uh, yeah, sped it up a little bit to two speed. Stop and go. Got ourselves another Tyranitrout on. This one's pulling us out a little bit. Could it be bigger than the 4.069? Was it 4.069 that we're currently leading with right now? Woo! God, that tension. That tension, man. Go! Just come in. Just get in here. I don't like the tension getting so low. Goodness gracious, bro. Hey, we beat our new... I knew it. I knew it when I saw how crazy this guy was being. That is awesome. Another Tyranitrout. We better take a photo with this guy. Just in case we don't get one bigger than this, you know? That is awesome. I am loving these Tyranitrout. They are so cool. Okay, let's go for another one. I think we're gonna have to mix it up here. Maybe we can cast over here. Do you think we'll pull them out of here? Four out of ten right now. <laughs> It's about to move back over to the other spot to try again a couple times over there, but I thought maybe I'd throw one more out here just to make sure we've gotten everything. Whoa, what is this? Whoa, this is another Tyranitrout. Ooh, look at that tension. Tension is low. The suspense is high, but the tension is low. Whoa, tension. Tension. Stay on, stay on. There we go. There we go. 4.001 Tyranitrout there. <laughs> Got you, bro. Got you. Okay, I'm gonna have to mix it up. We're gonna have to move on to another spot. Move on to a different spot. We've caught a, we've caught a few out of there. I don't think they're just gonna continue giving them to us. Better mix it up. Mix it up. Mix it up. You know, in a way, I almost feel like a Ghostbuster or something like that. Here's something big. Oh, we got ourselves another Tyranitrout. <laughs> when it's something strange in a rocky leg. Who you gonna call? Bo with the mask of a dinosaur applied to his face via paint. When there's teethy fish and they're swimming fast. Who you gonna call? The dude with a carnivorous salad on his face. And I just got copyrighted. Ooh, tension. Ooh, tension. I sound like a teacher. Detention! 14.158. That's not bad there. 14.158. This guy's feisty. He's trying to bite. That is awesome. I love these things. Goodness gracious. Okay, um, let's see. Let's t let's cast out here. What is going on? It's a Tyranitrout! Keep the tension! <laughs> Get over here! Get onto the freaking bank! Bro! Let's go! Another Tyranitrout down! Whoa, 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 whoa! I don't know why I keep doing that. As if that's the sound a dinosaur makes or something. <laughs> okay, where should we go this time? I don't even know. <gasps> I'll show you. Secret fishing spot. Secret fishing spot that we'll get a Tyranitrout out at. Up here. See, from here, you can cast way off into the rocks if you want to. Seven out of ten Tyranitrout. Could we just catch three more? Is that so much to ask for? Whoa! Oh, Tyranitrout! Tyranitrout! Get over here! Here we go! Tyranitrout! 14.174 pounds! Let's go! I don't know why I said 14. 4.174 pounds. Tyranitrout down! Let's go! You look like a green pineapple in a way. Or a pine cone. A blood-covered green pine cone with teeth and, and eyes and and fins. Oh, well. Another one down. Two to go, everyone. Uh, we've been catching them over here for quite a while. I don't know if we should mix it up or if we should just keep going. I, I don't know. 
They're hanging out on the rocks, don't you know? And they love to stop and go. They're hanging out in the rocks, don't you know? And they biting on that stop and go. Oh boy, this is... Is it? It is another one! No way! Are you serious? Oh my god! We're getting through these Tyranitrouts so fast! So fast! You crazy! You crazy Tyranitrout! Tyranitrout, you crazy, bro! Alright, we got one more to get. Let's see... Ooh, do we dare? Do we dare? We dare. We dare, bro. We dare. Play the Western music. It's high noon. Sorry, that was the jump on it song. Oh my gosh! Here we go! We got it! No way, don't, don't, don't ramp off that freaking rock, bro. No, no, no. Get on the bank! Let's go! 10 down! Like that. Like that. Indeed, that is amazing. We caught all 10 Tyranitrout. Ooh, and we made it look so easy. I am the smartest man alive. Big brain bow, catching all the Tyranitrout. And uh, it, I, I really have to think that most of it was due to this uh, just amazing Tyrannosaurus Rex face paint. Uh, that allowed us to be camouflaged and sneak in towards these, uh, you know, wonderful specimen of fish. Uh, we're definitely keeping all of these, of course. Let's see this, uh, trophy here. The Rocky Tyranitrout Monsters. Congratulations with your monsters catch. Here are some great rewards for you. Woo! All right, 1,690 experience, $2,100 and two bay coins with the Tyranitrout mount, of course. Uh, that is pretty freaking sweet. And of course, there we go, the Tyranitrout mount, which is awesome. We'll uh, close that out and uh, that's that's it, everyone. We got the Tyranitrout. How awesome was that? 10 Tyranitrout at that. Um, you can imagine how if you're a beginner player, the Tyranitrout is a great fish to go for. It wasn't that hard, was it? And uh, each one of them was 450 bucks, so you just made yourself $4,500, which could come in handy. I mean, obviously the, some of these are a little less, but you know, uh, which could come in handy if you're if you're a you know a player that hasn't made it too far. Not too shabby, everyone. Ten Tyranitrout down, and uh, and a lot of fun out here at uh, Rocky Lake. Haven't been here in a while, and uh, it was awesome to throw this uh, spoon around and uh, catch those giant, those giant Tyranitrout. Tell you what, I hope this video was entertaining and helpful if you're uh, trying to get a Tyranitrout of your own. If you ever want to join in with our streams, of course, 7.30 to 9.30 p.m. Central every Wednesday night. Come fish with us wherever we may be. Uh, you know, we like to go for some of the big fish, but of course, sometimes we uh, go towards what the community is demanding and uh, we, we go somewhere where the community can go fishing. So if there's enough people who want to fish with me at a, uh, you know, a lower level place, and we'll try to make it happen, of course. Uh, but yeah, it's all about having fun, and we hope to see you in the next uh, live stream. Like the video if it was helpful or entertaining at all. Subscribe if you're just now finding the BZ Hub and you're not thinking that this person with this uh, these crazy green mountains and and a, a pit full of spikes on his face isn't isn't a crazy person. Then then go ahead and hit that subscribe button because I really appreciate it. You know, <laughs> and. Welcome to the BZ Hub. It's great to have you. So excited to keep on going through these monster fish this Halloween season. So let's end it here. Happy Halloween, everyone. And as always, remember, we're one planet, one family. Game on.